this is Belinda, and I want to welcome you to the School of Spiritual Evolution and our event, Making Room Within for Divine Assistance. So I just have a couple of quick um, announcements before I channel the angels. I'm Belinda Womack, and I have been blessed to be a messenger for these amazing beings for over 30 years. And my short story of how the School of Spiritual Evolution came to be is I got myself in a pickle. That's a very American way to say that it's, it was a bit, as my Australian friend would say, a train smash. And so the angel sent in a little bit of a divine intervention, some divine assistance. And that is how the School of Spiritual Evolution came to be with the help of Deborah Langford. So she built the school and we moved all of the angels courses to this beautiful new place. And so we are celebrating the opening and there's all kinds of gifts and things that goes right over Belinda's head. So when we get to the end of today's lesson and meditation with the angels, I will bring Deborah on and she can share that with you. Also, you will be getting this information in emails and, and things like that. So what is most important is that we thank you so much for being here. Being on Schoolroom Earth takes a lot of courage and being willing to let yourself be helped. That's from the angel's perspective. That takes a lot of courage too. So I'm going to take a quick drink of water. I can channel with my eyes open. I prefer to close my eyes so that I can see these amazing beings. I ask that you please just take a deep breath in and relax. Here we go. Most brave and courageous human being. We acknowledge your radiance. Whether you are here live with us, you are always live with us. We are the 12 archangels of the central sun, flooding you with love from creator's heart, from our hearts. Now, where do we begin? First of all, we would like to share with you that we have gathered, we have invited your own team of helpers in heaven because they want to help you. And so as you are listening to us, please open your minds and your being to let the help in. A very powerful, simple, you can call it prayer, you can call it meditation, mantra, intention is, I am willing. I am willing to experience the miracle of divine assistance, especially in the areas of my life where I have been resisting receiving assistance. It all begins with this, your will. So when you are willing to be assisted, human being, your life is going to get better. So we want to speak to you a little bit about Miracles. And miracles happen all the time. They happen all the time, but you may not be aware of the miracles 
that are everywhere and the miracles that want to come to you. Miracle is another word for divine assistance. Miracles can be surprising. Sometimes they can even be shocking. And sometimes they can be the last thing that you expect. So we come back to your willingness. Your willingness to receive assistance. For as you are willing, this allows the miracles, the divine assistance to flow to you in the most surprising and astonishing ways. There is a divine law that goes as above the vibration of heaven, so below the vibration of earth. That would mean your everyday life. As within you, so without you. When you need more of heaven's vibration, when you need more of heaven's vibration to flow into your humanity, we need to help you make room within. Very simply, when you want to experience more heaven in your everyday life, more undiluted love, more miracles, more grace, more ease, more understanding, more opportunity, then you need to have this vibration of love saturating your humanity so that it is in your within and appears, it will appear in your so without. This is divine law, and it is a very essential law for all of those who want to live a happier life. We want to explain something to you about divine assistance. You see, mi miracles and angels go together, and angels prove to you that they're real by the miracles that you experience. But we want to share our difficulty, our conundrum around miracles and angelic assistance. Angelic assistance also is the same as allowing your soul to help you. That's your higher self. We all work together. In your human brain, there has been, well, we'll just call it a lie placed there. It is made out of fear. And it was put in your brain a very, very long time ago. And what this lie or this, we'll say this patch of fear in your brain, what it does is it makes you want to be sleepy. And two things happen from this sleepiness. It makes you forget to ask for assistance. And when the assistance comes, it makes you think that it came from outside of you, that it came from just coincidence. We must be frank with you. We don't really like coincidence because we don't believe in it. You are the creator of your life. Our job is to help you create a happier life. And so what we want to offer you that we have never offered before, because we love to bring through Belinda things that she does not know, so that she too receives a miracle, a surprise, a learning. Within your brain, there is a lie, a piece of fabric that is made out of fear. And fear, what is it? 
it actually has love still inside of it. Because all things come from creator's energy. But when you take creator's energy and you lower it in vibration, as low as it can go, and only on schoolroom earth, you have something called fear. And fear takes your energy away. It takes your personal power away. It takes your awareness away. It gobbles up your freedom and your confidence. And this particular patch of fear that's located in what you would call your masculine part of your brain, where your ego lives. But there's more than just your ego that lives here. There's a door to your deep subconscious that stores lots of fear. Your shadow self lives here. And this particular lie or patch of fear was placed in the human brain when world religions began and even a bit before this time. What are we trying to say to you? That we're going to take this out of your brains. Now, do not be afraid. For we have your soul, your higher self. We have your soul's blessing to do this. And why do you want to let this lie go? This patch of fear in your brain? Because it makes you sleepy. It puts a blind. It's like pulling the shade, the window shade, down over your inner eye so that you forget you're distracted and you do not see. You do not acknowledge the miracles of divine assistance that are happening for you and are lining up to come into your movie, into your reality. And why does it matter? Why does it matter for you to have awareness of these miracles of the divine assistance. Because as your awareness increases, you ask for more. It's human nature. And we think it's absolutely brilliant. So our gift to you is to help you to remove this lie, this piece of fear that makes it easy for you to fall asleep and think, oh no, this is my responsibility. This I cannot give to my soul. I cannot give this to my helpers. This belongs to me. Forgive us for being so clear, so direct. But what we hear you say is, this is my problem to solve. This is my toilet to scrub. This is my money to earn, even if I am miserable. This is my sorrow to deal with. This is my pain to endure. And it's not my happiness to enjoy. As we remove the lie, your brain wakes up to a new vibration of love. We raise the window shade so that you can see, I have help for me. Help is everywhere. I am never alone. And one more thing, removing this piece of fear, this lie out of your brain, it helps your willingness, beautiful being. It helps your willingness to let the 12 archangels help you 
in a very direct and beautiful way. And that is to help you to have awareness of the fear that is stored in your deep subconscious so that you practice forgiveness and you step out of the past that continues to repeat because the past does that. And we love to help you let go of the past, whether it's your past or your past lives past or the past of your ancestors, of your parents. You can continue to live in the past when forgiveness has not reached all of the places that it needs to reach. And that is what we love to do. You can say that we are subconscious specialists. We love to help you go to those places that feel so lost and forgotten, and yet they are still generating heartache and confusion, loss of yourself. That is what all of our courses are about. Each one is different, and each one is sacred, and each one is designed to help you break free, break free of fear, step into happiness and greater abundance. This is our joy. And so, let us go after that lie, that piece of fear that is housed in your masculine brain. What we ask for you to do is take a deep breath. And if you are left-handed, left-handed, you will find this fear or dark, well, it looks like a dark piece of grass to us. You will find it above your right ear. And if you are right-handed, you will find this above your left ear. Location isn't important because we're helping you. Your soul is guiding you. But we have noticed some human beings really like the details. You have an inner child that lives within your heart. And this inner child, wow, what a powerful source of love this child is. And you need this child's help. Now we call your inner child your divine inner child. Because this child is a key that awakens your divinity but it doesn't let you separate from your humanity, this key. This key of unconditional heart love and joy and laughter and innocence that wants to return to you. This key that your divine inner child is going to give to you for this special exercise. It removes fear because you see, that's what love does. As soon as the energy of love touches the dark grass, the dark spot, the lie, it's transformed. You have taken your deep breath. Before you, don't worry if you don't visualize because we're with you. It's all working. But do enjoy feeling the love. There's a purple door that swings open into a beautiful emerald meadow. And there you will find yourself. But this is your divine inner child self. 
So she or he is quite young and happy, innocent, free of abuse, free of the past, free. They have resting on a purple cloth, a huge golden key. And you're just going to take the key. Don't worry if you do not see the key. We are with you. We are helping you and guiding you, as is your higher self, your divine feminine, your divine masculine, your divine child. A set of stairs appears and you walk up the stairs to that place we described that's either just above your right ear or your left ear. And don't worry if you get the two mixed up because we are with you, willing one, willing human being. We are with you. You're going to walk into a dark room and there's a dark door and you're gonna place the key in the lock and that's, you're done. And then it is our job. We open this door and we vacuum up the fear. We remove the lie. So let us do this. You have received the key. Please say, I am willing. I am willing for my awareness of miracles, divine assistance, the presence of my helpers in heaven, the presence of my loved ones in heaven, for this to increase greatly my awareness. And you put the key into the lock of the dark door and you stand back. And we step in you may feel us or see us. Big, beautiful rainbow pillars of color. And we vacuum out the lie. We absorb it in, into our own selves. For you see, when we come together with you, we are all united in oneness. And we lift out the lie, and it is gone. It is gone. And now what we need for you to do is to repeat. Saturate me with love, 12 archangels, helpers in heaven. Flood me with love. My entire brain, my entire being, I allow. And in this space, a slide appears. It's ruby red, it's soft, it's not scary. You slide right back into the emerald meadow. Your divine inner child is there. And this child invites in your family members in heaven, your helpers in heaven, the ascended masters helping you. Of course, we are here. The 12 archangels, 
your guardian angels, any other helpers in heaven whom you may need their assistance. And this is what we invite you to do, is listen first. Listen. Where do I need divine assistance, you ask yourself? Where do I need this? And we tell you, it is already happening. But for you to tell us ramps up your awareness. It shifts your vibration so that you bring in more of as above into your so below. It makes it easier for your logical brain to recognize, oh, an angel just rescued me. I am grateful. So in this silence, in this sacred space, we are listening. Tell us, where do you need divine assistance? And we thank you for your willingness to let us help you. We so love to help you. We shall return. Take your time. And we give you our assistance. We give it to you and to your very atoms, human divine one. We send undiluted love from source into all the places within you where you may not realize, but you have agreed to take on the story for the human collective. And these places can feel heavy. It can feel like you'll never be able to lift up the endless sorrow or guilt or fear. And so, we are doing some heavy lifting through you, for you, and for the one human body 
and for school remark. And the love is flowing in, binding, lifting, raising, transforming. This is our gift, and this process is going to continue for all of your days. Because you see, you are willing. It is not that we play favorites. We love every human being. But for those who are not willing, our divine assistance stays at arm's reach, if not even a further distance. And for those who are willing to experience miracles and to let the 12 archangels help you rise up on the spiral of spiritual evolution closer to your divinity, then we can accomplish great things together, beloved one. We come as a team. When you call on Gabriel or you call on Zadkiel, we all come. And we ask for you to be willing to understand this because it increases the power. Human beings get taught to separate things, to put this miracle, this blessing in this box, this archangel or this angel in those boxes. We tell you the truth. We work through a divine oneness. We come as a unified force. So when you call on highest truth through Archangel Michael, no, we all come to help you to reach those unreachable places within, to lift them, to love them, to raise the frequency back to love so that you experience greater freedom and awareness and awakening. We are the 12 archangels of the central sun. We thank you so much for listening to us, for letting us love you. And we invite you to explore our school of spiritual evolution. And here's one more thing before we ask our Deborah to speak. Let us know if you find that something is missing in our school. Our hearts love to give. So if you find something, something that you love, that you want more of, from our perspective, our school is so complete that we are willing to experience the miracle that through you, we reach all of the sleeping, nearly dead human being. But do let us know. We invite you. It is a sanctuary of love that has been created for you. Blessing. We're going to bring Belinda back. Good 
This is Belinda. I am totally dizzy. Just give me a second. Okay. Wow, those angels can really bring in the love. So I am going to, uh, with my dizzy brain, that's very, very happy. I am going to ask Deborah to please, Deborah Langford, to please unmute herself and share a little bit of what's being uh, the gifts that are coming from the School of Spiritual Evolution. Hi, Belinda. Hi, everyone on the call. Um, I'm Deborah, and um, as Belinda said, I have been um, assisting her with the School of Evolution. Um, I, I'm just going to be led. I'm also, like Belinda, a little bit dizzy at the moment. But I just, it's on my heart to share with you um, something that happened when I woke up this morning um, and and what happened now. You've all come on here for a reason. Um, Belinda put the call out. And when Belinda went through everything um, now, I saw two stairways um, going up. And one, um, I could see my inner child on the stairwell. Um, and it was light and it was it was going up into the heavens and it was beautiful there were a, there was a lot of blue and I wondered why am I seeing two stairways and then I saw the other stairways went up much higher and it was ancient stairs really ancient stairs with this big ancient door and when I came in, I had a big old key in my right hand. And I was asking the angels, why am I seeing two stairways? I knew the one because I could see my inner child playing on the stairs was mine on the left hand side. But there was one center stage, massive. And um, I just, I got the message, that is the stairway to the school of ever, uh, spiritual evolution it's ancient it houses our teachings and that key that is in your right hand put it in the door and when i woke this morning i would i was told that i would see a hundred a hundred people that counted in order for the school's doors to open and they're, they're open, the most magnificent rainbow colors, light coming out of the doors now as I speak. So it was, um, I was told I would see a hundred. And I thought to myself, okay, so it's a hundred people coming, even though we've had a couple of hundred people register. And I kept looking at the count and it stayed on 99. And just before Belinda started to speak, it shifted to 100. So that in there was a lesson for Deborah because I was told I would see 100. And the doors are wide open and the 100 that is on this call are here for a reason. You have the heart, you have the love that was needed to unlock the doors for the School of Spiritual Evolution. And so I needed to share that with you because that is what I'm getting. And I thank you. I send you much love and gratitude for your assistance. You will hold that frequency and love consciously and subconsciously for the school. The school is an ancient school. It belongs to the 12 archangels. And Belinda and Deborah have done this before. And um, and so I just um, I'm, I've been guided to share that with you. Um, yeah, so um, <laughs> I'm a little bit dizzy, but um, yeah, so I think that explains a lot. Um, I just wanted to say um, I'm Deborah. Um, the school. Um, doing the school and assisting Belinda 
is something that was a divine spiritual contract for both Belinda and I. And, um, and so we are just fully fulfilling that. And um, I send you much love, much gratitude. And I am privileged to do this and to assist Belinda. And I ask you to bear with me um, much of the stuff, 99% of the stuff I've done myself. The first time I asked somebody else to assist me with an email, they left the link out <laughs> to the very first email. And I was kind of like it was a lesson and a message to say, um, you, you've been tasked to do this yourself. And so um, if you find little things that are not right or, you know, that you want changed or you don't quite like something, um, we are working on things and everything that we do is done with the most high divine frequency of love, just as um, the angels want us to do it. And so I am Deborah. I love you. And um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> And uh, yeah. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you. And she lives in Australia. Yes. Sorry, I'm... Belinda. You 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 didn't come through. Were you? What did you say? I didn't hear you. I wanted to say that Deborah is in Australia, and I live in Montana. So it's a 16 hour difference. So that's also quite something to get things coordinated. And I believe you told me, she gave me things that I was supposed to remember. So I'm asking the angels to help me. She has um, created a new YouTube channel. And so we're gonna be posting some fun things up there. Uh, one of the things is that I love to interpret metaphor. That means the events that happen to us in life. The angels teach, they use metaphor in everything that they teach. And so those are going to be going up. So please, it's on the school uh, website to sign up for the to subscribe. That's what it's called. Thank you, angels. Mm -hmm. To the YouTube channel. That would be great. And the other thing is, if you go, when you visit the school's website to the retreat pages, we've had to do quite a, a re, I don't know, rearrangement. We're going to have one retreat, not two retreats. And the one retreat, I've not done this before, it's going to be awesome, will be in close to my backyard, not in my backyard, but in Whitefish, Montana, uh, October 3rd to the 5th. And so all the details for that will be up soon. It's that we thought we were gonna have two retreats, but we're gonna have one retreat. So thank you for your patience with that. And the last thing, Deborah, you can correct me, but I believe you wanted me to say that for Right now, there's a um, there's also a ten percent discount for anything anybody wants to yep. uh, any course that anybody wants to purchase on the uh, website, and also there's gifts. We're trying to give away a scholarship to the advanced. It's called their Ascension Trainings. It's the GP, and um, so we'd really love to be able to give that scholarship away. So did I forget anything? No, I'm sorry. I was a little bit with the angels. <laughs> so I didn't um, do what I was supposed to do. But yeah. Um, so um, yeah, so I'm busy um, doing, I, I think in the email that um, that everyone got this morning, there is a code at the bottom, um, a discount code that you can use for your 10% discount. And um, what I'm going to do in the next week, um, people will receive a link to a page where there are um, the special offers are explained and discounts on certain things. Um, I've, what I've tried to do is break up courses that the old students have, but that but the new information separated so that they're able to um, just purchase the new thing without the other remembering that there is a lot of students that are going to be coming in 
um, because that's what the, the archangels wanted. The reason for the school is, is to take it to the world. So, um, and that's what we've set up. So it's trying to juggle, allowing the old students to buy things in courses separately and then catering for the other people coming in that need the bundle packages. So all of that will be shifting and it will be um, clearer this week um, when I've built out the page, I can actually give you a link to it and then you can look and you can use your um, discount um, code. The other thing is with the YouTube channel, a lot of um, your new metaphor teachings, a lot of new exciting things are coming there. Um, so that's the reason for actually joining that uh, the School of Spiritual Evolutions YouTube. In the latest email, there is a button to, to join. And I'll be uploading all the new um, videos from today. Wonderful, wonderful. And yes, it is an international school. I don't have my chat open, but I saw that question uh, pop up. Uh, that's the, it's been an in international teachings from the 12 Archangels. I've been their messenger for over 30 years and students have come from all over the world. But we need to we need to reach those that don't know about the teachings of the 12 Archangels, because there's just so much love and what they want to share and truth. And it works fast what they what they offer. I really want to thank you for your time. I know Deborah thanks you for your time. And before we turn off the recording, I just want to let you know the 12 Archangels are omnipresent. They, they don't just hang out with Belinda or with Deborah. They are present for every human being. And when you ask for their help, even if you say, okay, show me you're here, they know how to do that. They especially love to help world changers and awakeners and um, People who feel a call, a passion to help, to make this world better and to clear out that old story of suffering. So if that's in your heart, fall on them. Experience a bit of their divine assistance. It's quite something. Blessings, blessings, and love. Thank you for taking time to join us on this call and may we meet again soon. Much love, bye-bye.